Hi guys, I'm here today with this Ribosan dual wireless microphone karaoke system. So it comes with these two microphones and also with this basic mixer desk, but it has basically everything what we need for volume control, some basic effects. It's very easy to connect, has a lot of inputs, a lot of outputs. So it could be an awesome karaoke starter set or even to use for an event or business. So I'm going to take it out of the box, show you what you get and then how to use it. And so here's again the box with some description, also some features here in the back. But let's open it, see what we get. Everything comes nicely protected, comes with this user manual. Yeah, I think there's a lot of description here, a lot about the different input and output. That's also very good. And we get a lot of cables. We get this USB-C power cable. We get uh, 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter. We get this 3.5 millimeter to change. We get this wind socks. Then second change to 3.5 millimeter. We get even the batteries for the microphone because it's wireless. And so here we have the microphones. They're really nice, beautiful. And they come with a long wireless range. We can easily open here. And yeah, the battery is one like that. And the other one. And so we screw the cover here back. And same thing for the second one. And what you can see, it's really nice to have this orange or red here and the blue. So it's very easy to separate them. Also, when you are controlling the mixer desk, we also add the batteries here. And then we have the mixer, I would say it's really nice, beautiful one. Comes with these caution pads here, so it's not scratching anything. And so here's what we can adjust. That's the music level, then the microphone one level, microphone two level. I mean, these are the wireless microphones. And then we can add some echo and adjust the tone, power on, power off. We have two ports here for additional microphones. If you want to use some additional microphones on top of these wireless microphones and then in back we have HDMI input for example also as music, HDMI output for the TV, some other audio in and audio out and USB-C power port. So we have everything what we need comes even with its own USB-A power supply. And so I have everything connected. It took me just five minutes. Of course, it's just a very basic connection, but it already works. So the only wired connection which I have is the 3.5 millimeter in the audio out to the speaker here. And it's definitely recommended to use the 3.5 millimeter output and not the HDMI output for the speaker. It's not recommended to use this as audio to your TV because otherwise there will be some delay. The best option for the audio is to use the 3.5 millimeter jack. And the power goes into the USB-C. What's also really good is that we can also use USB-C to USB-C. That's not available for all devices, but this device has no problem with it. Really nice. And so we can turn it on here. And as soon as we have it turned on, it will also produce a Bluetooth connection. You can see that here, karaoke mixer. You can just click on that on your phone and then we pair it. And so I have here some free audio from YouTube and I can increase the volume and you can hear that. And now it's coming from this speaker. Of course, I could make a direct connection to the speaker, but when I connect it to the mixer, it allows me to control the music directly from here. This is what we want. And now, of course, we want to add the microphone. And so we push the button here on the right side for two seconds. It will go automatically on channel one. And we do the same thing here on the right side. We can see it goes into channel 2. We can see also the frequency sometimes it is alternating here showing the channel and the frequency and also the battery level. If you want to change the channel we can do that just push here on the left side and it will change the channel. You can see that here if there's some interference we can always change the channel. Just give it some time to properly adjust it here for the receiver till you have a proper connection. And so we have now both microphones activated and I could increase the volume here. But of course, 
I'm very close, it will give some back coupling, but I'm trying here a little bit further away. I'm now using microphone number one, and this is microphone number two, microphone number one, microphone number two. So I reduce the gain here, that was without the windsock. Now I'm going to apply the windsock. First one is done. So let's also do that for the second one. What I heard so far from the microphone was really good, but it has a little bit of a pop effect when you are too close. So I'm trying now with the pop filter. So let's increase the volume again on both of the microphones. Microphone test, microphone one, microphone test, microphone two. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. I have really, really nice connection for both of them. I alternate microphone one, microphone two, microphone one, microphone two. Yeah, so I'm back here. Of course, when I'm back close here, I have to reduce the volume and I reduce also the music volume because everything has been working really good. And so let's see if you can also use some special effects, by the way, to turn off a microphone. So I'm pushing here on the right side long, get the off notification. So we have now only the microphone one. And so we bring back the music here, activate the echo effect. So let's do that here. Test, 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 test. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. Sounds like in a big stadium. Okay, that was pretty cool. I reduced this. And so let's change the tone here. You can hear there's a little bit of a difference. It definitely goes into higher pitch sound when I increase this, but there's also a large risk for back coupling. So I reduce this here again. I would say this is the natural voice, natural tone here. Absolutely perfect for me. Yeah, I'm super happy with it. It is very easy to use. It has everything what we need. I would say it's a decent quality. Of course, it's not like a professional quality or so, but I would say these microphones really, really convince me. I love that these microphones uh, have a really good audio quality, really natural tone. Everything is super easy to connect. You don't need instructions manual. Just power it in, use 3.5 millimeter, connect the sound with Bluetooth or also line. It is super easy. Really, everybody can use that. And we have all the functions here. So I would say pretty cool device for the price. Again, it's not a professional quality set. Of course, there will be always some very low level noise. But if you're doing karaoke or just using it for a private event, for a wedding or something like that, it will be absolutely perfect. And so if you're interested, I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it. And I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.